Hello everybody, this is Sharon, and I have another mini album I'd like to share with you today. Um, I created this one for my daughter. She's getting married in October, and um, so it's going to be a surprise. I just wanted to see if I could do a uh, photo album for her, and um, she's not a crafter, so it's not, you know, really embellished that much. It's um, mostly just for photo mats and things like that, and um, so we'll go ahead and get started. Um, this is an 8x10 um, album and the paper collection I use is this Bridal Bliss by Recollections um, really beautiful um, paper collection I picked that up at Michaels and um, so the front right here I just started off with some of this gray um, cardstock then I layered some white some more gray and then the paper collection over the top of that and then I um, cut this out of the paper collection and just matted it with some white cardstock and some gray cardstock there are these little flowers here. These came from Hobby Lobby. And then I tied this bow. And um, it doesn't go all the way around the mini album. It's just on the top page. And then I layered um, some little stickers right here that I picked up at um, either Hobby Lobby or Michaels. I'm not sure. And so I think this paper collection is really, really pretty um, for a mini album. For Well, it's not really a mini album, but for um, a wedding. So for this page right here... Um, I just did a lot of flaps and um, things like that and most of the mats are for um, 5x7s and 4x6s and so um, this right here both of these are 4x6 mats right here and then this came from the paper collection and I just layered um, some more of the little flowers there and I left this open so if, um, if she wanted to put a picture up under that it, you know it's open so she could stick a picture up under that and so it just opens like this right here and like I said these are four by six uh, photo out, um, photo mats and so it just opens like that and then you have um, this big place right here where you could put your pictures and then up here at the top you also have um, two photo mats this is um, a four by six and this is a five by seven so, um, like I said, I think this paper is really, really, um, really pretty. And so I just kind of stagger them like that and um, just sort of have a, a nice look to it when, you, when you're showing it. Anyway, it goes like that. And these are all held with um, magnets, too. And then on this side right here, I have a, um, a shaker page right there. And um, so I just did that with like the silver um, sequins. It has some gold uh, glass glitter in there, and um, and some little white uh, micro beads are in there. And then this right here, this little uh, die cut right here, is from La La Land. And then I just layered some lace behind that. Um, this is from the paper collection. And then these two flowers, I think I picked these up at um, either Michaels or Hobby Lobby. And so this one just, um, and this is a sticker from the um, a sticker sheet that I had. And so this one just layers, uh, lifts up like this. And you have um, this place right here and this place right here for photos. And then this lifts up again. You have this place and then you have all of this right here for photos. And these are 5x7 uh, photo mats. And then um, it also opens this way. And you have all of this room um, right here for photos. And this is a beautiful chandelier. And then this is just married. I hope you guys can see that. So that's that paper is really, really pretty. And then on the next page, um, this one right here um, is four, two 4 by 6 photo mats here. And um, it just lifts up like this right here. And this is from the paper collection, just to cut out. And I just put some more flowers from Hobby Lobby there. And so this lifts up like this. And you have the back of this. And then you have this one. Then this lifts up. And you have the back of this. And then you have two. Um, the way I do it is like I do like two four by six photos would fit, you know, like that. Um, that's just the way that I like to do it. And so, um, two 4 by 6 photos would fit there. And since I'm probably going to be the one printing the pictures and putting them in here, I thought I would 
make it easier for me. <laughs> but um, and then this one opens up like this, and you have um, a five by seven photo mat, a four by six photo mat, and then this is a heart. I just stuck that in there for journaling. And um, this is the way the mats look. Beautiful paper on there. And this right here is a Spellbinders die I just put across the bottom and just layered a, a cutout from the paper collection. And then um, this is just a regular photo mat here. And then I have um, two 3x2 two photo mats right here. And then these are candles in the background. I think it's so, so pretty. And then I did the same thing as I did over here. The Spellbinders die and then the cutouts from the paper collection. And then the little hearts... Um, border is a, just a Martha Stewart punch. Um, it's a corner punch, but I didn't, of course, do the corners, but that's the way that one looks. Um, this side right here lifts up, and this is a 4x6 as well. This lifts up, and you have a 4x6 photo for a uh, mat here and here, and then this one pulls out, and you have um, a big photo frame right here. And like I said before, this will hold um, two 4 by 6 pictures, you know, really good, like that. And then you can also, you know, layer your pictures behind that if you wanted to, and just kind of stick them down in that pocket. And these two pages right here, um, this is kind of in the middle of the mini album. And so I just did uh, two belly bands, exactly the same thing. Um, these are all stickers just from a sticker sheet that I picked up. And then these are um, the big um, photo mats that you can put your 4x6 uh, pictures on. And you can also layer some on the back right here. And if I'm not mistaken, um, I counted about 85 um, places for pictures if you do like 4x6 and 5x7 uh, pictures. And this one's beautiful paper. And it looks like that. I have a little heart sticker down there at the bottom on this one. And this page right here is like a gateful card. Um, this is another cutout from the paper collection. And then this is from this, one of the sticker sheets. And it just opens like this right here. And you have um, these two places right here and then this big place for pictures. And then I have another... Um, big photo mat right here that um, you can put your pictures on really pretty and this one is a little bit um, tight so I hope when we put pictures on that it'll it'll be okay I hope so and then um, on this side um, this just opens like this um, a place up here for pictures these are both 4 by 6 um, photo mats here. So you have these two. This big space right here. And um, that says Just Married there. And then this opens like this. And you have um, a 5 by 7 photo mat here. 4 by 6 photo mat here. And then you can put your pictures here as well. And then you have another, um, the heart border punch goes all the way across here. This is uh, cut out from the paper collection. I just backed it on some white card stock. And this is from that sticker sheet. And I think I just picked that up at Michael's or Hobby Lobby. And then this side is um, basically the same thing. Just two um, photo mats. 4x6 uh, and 5x7. And I just did another um, pocket page for that. And this is from the paper collection. And then I have um, some stickers here and here from um, that sticker sheet. And then this page right here, um, both of these are 5 by 7 photo mats. This is from the paper collection. I just cut that out and then uh, triple layered that on some gray and white cardstock. And then these two flowers, I picked these up, I think, at Hobby Lobby. And then this this up this way, and you have this place for 5x7. You have a place right here for 5x7, and then it opens this way. And let me see if I can slide that up. And it's just a picture of the, the tuxedo and the bow tie and everything. Really pretty paper. 
and then this side right here is another pocket page. Um, this is that heart border from Martha Stewart. Then I have a 4x6 photo mat right here. There's the back of it. And then this is a 5x7 photo mat. And it has one of the beautiful stickers on there. It says True Love. And that's the back of that. And, um, and then this lifts up. And you have a place here. Um, you know, a couple places here. And you could probably put two or three pictures there. And then it also lifts up this way. And you have this place here. And then this place right here. So, um, there's a lot of places for pictures. This is another chandelier picture here. And, um... So I hope she's going to like it. Like I said, she's not a crafter. And I know that she, you know, is just going to hand it right back to me and say, Mommy, you do the pictures. I don't know how to do that. Um, this is the back of it right here. And it has, like, the, uh, the pictures of the candles on there. And then on the side, I just layered some paper collection. I may put uh, a place for a date right there. I haven't made my mind up yet. And, um... So that's how it turned out. I hope you guys like it. If you have any questions, just let me know. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.